Good morning, boys and girls. It is day 16. Can you believe it? Day 16 of Art with Angela. Now today, I don't know where you live, but where I live, it has done nothing but rain and rain and rain. And I'm getting kind of tired of it. So I thought, mm, maybe if we draw spring, it will become spring and it will become happier and brighter outside. So that's why I have my bee wings on. Now, I'm gonna bring it up for parents. Uh, way back in like 1992, there was a band called Blind Melon and they sang a song called No Rain. And when I put this on this morning, especially with the sneakers, I thought, oh my gosh, I look like that little girl in that video, all I need is the big glasses. But anyway, okay, pick up your pens, your pencils, your crayons, your colored pencils and your paper, and let's get going. We are going to draw a B today. Ready? Here we go. Now, let's start out with, let's start out with like a little circle, but we're not gonna end the bottom of it. So we have kind of a circle and we didn't finish it here. Eh, you know what, what the heck, let's finish it. All right, now we have a circle. Now let's make an egg shape, but at the bottom of our egg shape, instead of connecting it, let's make the point where he's got a little stinger on him. I think I got a little stinger on the back of my wings. So let's go ahead and put stripes on our B. And let's give him a couple little eyes just for fun. He's getting cute already. Now wings. Let's go ahead and do one big wing and then let's do a little tiny one. That keeps him kind of stable so he knows how to fly. Now let's give him another wing here and a smaller one underneath it. And then of course every bee needs his little antennas. So now we have a cute little bee. Now we don't want just a bee on this picture. We could, but we're artists. So let's take it another level. Let's give him some flowers. Now, to draw a flower, let's do one that we're only gonna see the top of. So we're gonna do a football shape, just like that. Now, instead of putting the flowers all up and around it like that, we're only gonna bring them down to the bottom. We'll do all the petals and we'll put them like this. And so we have a flower that he can land on easily. Now, maybe over here, we'll have one that we look at kind of the normal, like right straight on. And let's give this some big, fluffy, petals oh and then let's even give them some stems because they have to be connected to something and maybe a couple leaves maybe a big old leaf there now if we want to show like the bee has been traveling and we want to show motion let's go ahead and make a little dotted line like this this is going to show where the bee has come from he even made a big loopy doop before he stopped for a picture so that shows the bee came in and twirled and now he's right there in front of us. Now here comes the fun part, as always, the coloring. Let's start out with yellow because that's a good one to start with. Let's go ahead and do his head yellow. And then let's do the next stripe. We're going to do a pattern, yellow, black, yellow. So let's do the yellow here. And I think I even want the centers of my flowers to be yellow. So while I've got the yellow out, we're going to color those in. And then this really cool one that he can sit on where you just see the top of it. All righty. All colored. Let's see, what can we do next? Let's do, I'm going to do my flowers orange. You can do your flowers any color. They can be a bright garden. Oh, I went outside the lines again, but I'm trying to color quickly. Did everyone hang their eggs in the window from yesterday? I was a little slow. I just hung mine this morning, but it's out there. So if you walk past the studio, you're going to see my egg in the window. So I'm all ready for the egg hunt. All righty. Now let's go ahead and use some green since we put some stems in there. And remember, you can have many, many more flowers if you want to. It's totally and completely up to you because you are the artist. And there we go. And then let's go ahead and do blue. We're missing one of the most important colors. I bet you already know what color. Let's go around the wings and leave those wings white. Even though mine are yellow. I guess you could paint them yellow if you wanted to. Again, you're the artist, so you make the call what everything is gonna look like. Again, my sloppy coloring, you're gonna do a whole lot better. And now let's get our black and let's do the bumblebee 
every other stripe is going to be black, so it really, really looks like a bumblebee. Okay, boys and girls, show me your drawings. I want to see them. I want to see how great you're doing. I am so happy that you join me every day. It has been as much fun for you, as, or as much fun for me as it is for you. Honestly, I enjoy doing this every day and getting silly, of course, with these silly little outfits. Now, tomorrow when you tune in, we're gonna do something for all the people that are missing their sports, that can't go to baseball games or football games or watch them on TV or even go to practices to become great athletes. So tomorrow, tune in because we're gonna do something all about sports. Now, same thing I tell you every day, stay safe, wash your hands, listen to your parents, stay creative, everyone. Draw, 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 draw. Show me those pictures and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye now. Bzzz.